Hey guys, Captain Zach here. Well, we have a bright, sunny, just beautiful spring morning. It's the, the very end of April, really the beginning of the 2022 season. Uh, the halibut fishing is always a little slow this time of year, so we're not expecting a ton, but we're, we're, we're super excited to be out here. Uh, like I said, just an awesome morning. The seas are around one to two feet. We're about right at the low tide, so this would be a really good time for the fish to turn on right now. We're just soaking some jigs. I'm, uh, I'm putting that eight ounce fire eye glow ball to work. I've got it loaded up with some bait and excited to, to give that a go. And Mary's soaking a, a fire eye glow jig, so we'll see what, what hooks up first. Going down with an eight ounce fire eye glow ball, a nice strip of squid, and two pieces of herring. That ought to get them. You on? Oh, look at this. Yes. Hallie? Hard to say. Oh, it came off. Oh. Oh, man. There's something <laughs> down there. Come on. Let's get it. Oh, well, that looked like it had a decent pull to it. Maybe I just really want to see those head thumbs, but. I mean, did it feel like there were a couple of thumps right off the bat there? Yeah. But sometimes when you catch any fish. Yeah, anything will have a little bit of pull to it and a thump or two. I was asleep at the wheel. Had the rod in the holder. Suddenly it just goes goes off, goes thumping. By the time I picked it up, nothing. Nice! Fish on! Felt like there was something small playing with it. Missed it a couple of times. <laughs> Finally laid the hammer down. It's coming up awfully quick. <laughs> My guess is it's a small rockfish. If this is a halibut, this would be the, the smallest of chicken nuggets. <sighs> it's way down there. Nice. Rockfish. Dusky rockfish, that'll keep. Hey, I can just tell that's a rockfish. It's just... <laughs> Get out a rockfish jig. Fish on. Feels like another rockfish. They're fishing so deep that they start to lose their fight about maybe 30 or 50 feet off the bottom swim bladder starts to expand and they start coming up pretty easy. Yep, same thing. Nice little dusky. Nice. Fish on. Probably another little rockfish. We were just getting nibbled to death. They were just peck, peck, pecking away. So what I did was I scaled down the bait. I was using some longer strips initially on this uh, eight ounce fire eye glow ball. I decided to just scale the, the bait down to some smaller, smaller strips so they couldn't just grab the back and rip it off. And it seems to catch a rockfish every time. go three in a row oh see I said I scaled down what I did was I took these little pieces of herring and actually sliced them in half so you got a sort of a, a thin piece there to give you some hook clearance thin piece here for some hook clearance and then over here we got a little bit of uh, squid as well so just like a perfect little buffet plenty of hook clearance on each of those that'll nail them every time
Fish on. Had three in a row rockfish. Dropped it right back down. Got another hookup right away. This has maybe just a hair more fight to it. Way down there. It's a workout. Ah, oh, we got the first Howie of the season. Boom. <laughs> nice chicken Howie on that eight ounce fire eye glow ball. I think there might be something just like dead weight kind of thing on here. Rockfish. Yeah. Fish on. It's not a big fish, but one nonetheless. So important to keep the tension, especially on a small fish when you yank up and it pulls the fish five or 10 feet off the, off the floor. You gotta reel back down super quick. Make sure you get that tension really tight. Another nice dusky rockfish, we'll take him. Yeah. That took about five seconds after it hit the bottom. Just grabbed it immediately. <sighs> it's a workout. Sweet. Another nice dusky. We'll take him. Oh, I think we're getting ready to call it a day. It's just turning out to be such a super nice day. Uh, it feels like midsummer, honestly. So we're gonna go do some whale watching and maybe some stand-up paddle boarding as well. But the uh, the bite was uh, was slow as expected. Obviously, this early in the season, end of April, we really weren't expecting an explosive bite or anything. But that fire eye glow ball really delivered. So you know, despite not having a, a super hot bite, caught our first halibut of the season, which we're stoked about. And then also uh, those five nice keeper duskies. So a really nice rockfish take and the, uh, the first halibut of the season. Uh, awesome, just great. Juneau, Alaska.